kahit sa imong law profession. I understand you're a uh, law professor and you're mm-hmm. also a practicing lawyer. Yeah. Uh-huh. Kuan man ka no? Magna cum laude sa UP? Dilima. Yeah, sa yeah, business administration. You Magna cum laude ko sa... Got in, sa to, 04, I, I read somewhere na, na oh. sa bar ba to? Ah, no, no, no. Um, oh. So, I was magna... That's right. I, I graduated with honors, undergrad na akong mm-hmm. course, uh, business administration sa UP Diliman. And then sa law, um, honor society po ko. Mm-hmm. Order the purple feather tawag na. Uh, because it's very hard to get very good grades. Mm-hmm. The same, kay ang, ang determination ng gudaan ng magna, suma, cum laude. Oh, based on your grades, man good, no? Mm-hmm. Now, it's easier to get a high grade when you're in the undergrad. But when you're in the post grad or law law degree, mas, mas yeah. So uh, uh, you, you'll be happy, mga ko ag two five for instance. No? Um, sa undergrad mo hilak na ka ana na kay two five. Pero um, if you just pass your course sa law, lipay na ka. No? So um, uh, to be in the order of the purple feather, for instance, you need to have an average of less than two. So um, that's that's a very hard thing to do in law school. So I imagine you're a straight A student, kana. Uh, okay ka in those uh, in your student days not not so ano or natural lang kanang i wanted to have a balanced nga life mom gyud na kung ano good um, advocacy na uh, di lang sad ka pirmi magtutok sa academics yeah um, work life balance yeah, actually mo sa to ang impression nimo mm. cuz we met at a barman like years ago college pa ko <laughs> na tay common friends uh, I hear like attorney ka ni. I uh, saw bugoy lagi ning attorney na. Pala said bugoy oi. Ako nang kusog said mo ino. Pala uh, said kusog. Fun pero, fun lang fun. Like fun ba like well balanced niya. Uh, Kanang kana kum laude ana uh, teacher said uh, uh, diba you also yeah, teach. Yeah. Yeah. Until now right? Yes, you that's teach. right. That's right. Yeah, being balanced keeps you young man good. No? Yeah. Um, uh, it's all in the mind I think. So uh, yes I I I, I'm still teaching. It's, this is now my 16th year. You enjoy teaching, dude. Okay, Oban, Marag, what my patience? Yes, kanang. it has its uh, benefits. No, um, you get, you you remain sharp in your field. Ah, okay, you're teaching, updated with, with updated, the new books, then, new um, stuff. No, um, uh, ba, uh, Marag, engaging with students um, uh, keeps your mind sharp. What's so, your mind? Uh, views uh, kining millennial generation like the <laughs> newer generation the kids today ba like unsa ang changes from your generation no uh, i think the millennial generation is amazing uh, they're they're doing things na during my time were unheard of uh, ang, ang, i think ang ideas now are so spontaneous you can say anything you want and get away with it during our time and my time at least uh, you have to be careful especially uh, how you present yourself in public and then um, ang kanang, everything is right there you can do things um, with the click well, with yeah, the, with the information readily everything is right there so uh, I remember if I wanted to learn about something I have to go to the library or check the encyclopedia sa balay mas ya ya sa unan ang movement yes um the effort it took to learn was different back then unlike now you can fact check something immediately hmm. before mo huna huna sa ako ni distabik kay ako ni fact check so you know ah grabe i i i i'm amazed by you know the but these changing. days naman said no downside no with fake news that pass pass kay mukala no? uh, yeah. I, I, i think um but there's it's, also cancel culture, like some that's right, get that's right. so easily triggered, or these days think more of, people think are of it as a sword. Based. Think yeah. of it as a sword, so yeah, my, double-edged. Yeah. Um, Pros and on, cons. on one end is it you can hit somebody well. Hmm. On the other end is you can also hit, get hit. So um, the the faster lifestyles, the faster way of doing things, um, it can be a benefit as well as a curse, because um, because of how fast you are, you will you're bound to make mistakes drastic yeah. mistakes also for dependence and not on how we utilize these yeah. uh, advantages mm-hmm. because you don't think things through good you're not given that opportunity it can be misused mm-hmm. like 
he misused and abused. That's right. That's right. That's right. So, uh, going back sa imong like career, uh, taga Cebu jo ka, no? You hmm. grew up here. So I I was born here. Uh, born <laughs> here, so Cebuano. Yeah, apart. my mom is from Surigao, but my dad is uh, of, uh Cebu. Good. You come family. from a family of lawyers, or <coughs> my father was the first lawyer in his family. Um, okay. So, siya nagsugod sa trend sa mga dikdikan may mga lawyers. So dagan na kay mi karon. Dagan na lawyers. Um, ako lawyer, ako brother lawyer, ako sister lawyer. So what ultimately made you decide na morning field? Ah, ako i enter yes. early on when you were maybe a teenager. Yeah. No, well, I didn't want to be a lawyer. Um, the decision to enter law was made when I was uh, taking a vacation from my work. Um, at that time, I felt I was in a dead end job. Uh, financial analyst ko atong at time, and um, no, I complicated na ini. Oh, and then <laughs> my brother told me nga. Mm, I imagine stressful sa My brother told me nga murag buam kay padungan. No, uh, kami tanan mau postgraduate me because my brother was medical uh, nag med siya postgraduate ikaw undergrad ra sige I, I, I challenge myself sige mag postgrad po ko I looked at MBA punta pag ganaan mo ko mag MBA sa gawas niya mag lisod man mag, M- mag apply at that time mag short yeah. na kayong oras ba so the quickest nga, eh, nga postgraduate I could get into was law Hmm. So, how many how long man ang process and like, ah, dali man apply na man. <laughs> ah. di para sa MBA kung let's say you want to um, study an MBA in Michigan um, you you need to go through an entire process mo take pag TOEFL anong mga exams nila no um, and then uh, you have to write essays and then go through uh, interview process uh, law short term man ang process kaya naaraman din hi mm-hmm. sa Philippines so um I decided na I'll go for, I'll go for law. I'll try it. Nasud man ko. Ano to? Sunod sunod na. Ano <laughs> Calling day jud to. Okay. So, imong specialization now, uh, I think na kastorya man taga ah, yeah, yeah. Maybe in sa to you said you mentioned family and yeah, uh, um, property. We're not supposed to say a specialization. Or kay unsa ba na kanang sa tamo ang field murag uh, tamong profession gina considered as uh, unethical to specialize although in other countries it is not unethical it's the practice but in our uh, in our country um, we are supposed to be general practitioners general no so <laughs> yeah. broad and scope okay but um, i do have better knowledge more specialized knowledge in civil law and um ang civil law comprises kanang mga family law mga bawa ni mga annulment, nullification, um, kanang anything about marriage, uh, prenup, <laughs> prenup, oh, so kanang man ang mga family law, uh, obligations and contracts, um, contracts like sale, uh, lease, loans, guarantees, um, anything to do with uh, inheritance. So, kanang sang mga family constitution. Yes, like, kana no and then um, also kanang uh, quasi delict sub torts no uh, mga nang mga mag-aksidente. Uh, yeah, may mga damages. Mm. So man ang field sa sa uh, nga, I have a um, more specialized knowledge of kanang labor na sa kay Of course, we're general practitioners no? so yes, I've had experience with labor law. Um, although I don't like uh, the practice as much of labor law. Um, uh, nasa ko yung mga experience like sa criminal law pero minimal kayo. Um, corporate law, kamaupo ko. Kining transportation or <coughs> yes, credit transportation transaction? Is, <coughs> yes, transportation is uh, both a mix of civil and commercial law. Transportation like um, like uh, kanang, uh, mga bus, taxi, mm. Uh, airplane, so, uh, transport na. Tudlo ko na. Apil ni mga <coughs> Grab, Uber. Diba? Yes, yes. Sa Under na siya. Mga common carriers ba? Yeah. Uh, mga na sila. Uh, civil law na siya. Transportation mainly. Pero napoy yung mga commercial law aspect. Mm. 